What is Bitcoin? Bitcoin, BTC, is a cryptocurrency, a virtual currency designed to act as money and a form of payment outside. The control of any one person, group, or entity, thus removing the need for third-party involvement in financial transactions. It is rewarded to blockchain miners for the work done to verify transactions and can be purchased on several exchanges. Bitcoin was introduced to the public in 2009 by an anonymous developer or group of developers using the name Satoshi Nakamoto. It has since become the most well-known cryptocurrency in the world. Its popularity has inspired the development of many other cryptocurrencies. These competitors either attempt to replace it as a payment system or are used as utility or security tokens in other blockchains and emerging financial technologies. How to Mine Bitcoin A variety of hardware and software can be used to mine Bitcoin. When Bitcoin was first released, it was possible to mine it competitively on a personal computer. However, as it became more popular, more miners joined the network, which lowered the chances of being the one to solve the hash. You can still use your personal computer as a miner if it has newer hardware, but the chances of solving a hash individually are minuscule. This is because you're competing with a network of miners that generate around 220 quintillion hashes, 220 exahashes, per second. Machines, called application-specific integrated circuits ASICs, have been built specifically for mining, can generate around 255 trillion hashes per second. In contrast, a computer with the latest hardware hashes around 100 mega hashes per second, 100 million. To successfully become a Bitcoin miner, you have several options. You can use your existing personal computer to use mining software compatible with Bitcoin and join a mining pool. Mining pools are groups of miners that combine their computational power to compete with the large ASIC mining farms. Payment To use your Bitcoin, you need to have a cryptocurrency wallet. Wallets hold the private keys to the Bitcoin you own, which need to be entered when you're conducting a transaction. Bitcoin is accepted as a means of payment for goods and services at many merchants, retailers, and stores. Brick and mortar stores that accept cryptocurrencies will generally display a sign that says Bitcoin accepted here. The transactions can be handled with the requisite hardware terminal or wallet address through QR codes and touchscreen apps. An online business can easily accept Bitcoin by adding this payment option to its other online payment options, credit cards, PayPal, etc. Investing and Speculating Investors and speculators became interested in Bitcoin as it grew in popularity. Between 2009 and 2017, cryptocurrency exchanges emerged that facilitated Bitcoin sales and purchases. Prices began to rise, and demand slowly grew until 2017, when its price broke $1,000. Many people believed Bitcoin prices would keep climbing and began buying them to hold. Traders began using cryptocurrency exchanges to make short-term trades, and the market took off. In 2022, Bitcoin's price came crashing down. In March 2022, it was as high as $47,454 and as of November 2022, it is $15,731. The drop in Bitcoin is partly due to larger market turmoil related to inflation, rising interest rates, supply chain issues from COVID, and the war in Ukraine. Additionally, some important tokens have crashed in the crypto world, as well as one of the important exchanges, which has raised concerns about the stability of digital currencies. Risks of investing in Bitcoin Speculative investors have been drawn to Bitcoin after its rapid price appreciation in recent years. Bitcoin had a price of $7,167.52 on December. 31, 2019, and a year later, it had appreciated more than 300% to $28,984.98. It continued to surge in the first half of 2021, trading at a record high of $68,990 in November 2021, it then fell over the next few months to hover around $40,000. Regulatory Risk the lack of uniform regulations about Bitcoin and other virtual currencies raises questions over their longevity, liquidity, and universality. Security Risk 
Most individuals who own and use Bitcoin have not acquired their tokens through mining operations. Rather, they buy and sell Bitcoin and other digital currencies on popular online markets, known as cryptocurrency exchanges. Bitcoin exchanges are entirely digital and, as with any virtual system, are at risk from hackers, malware, and operational glitches. Is Bitcoin a good investment? Bitcoin has a short investing history filled with very volatile prices. Whether it is a good investment depends on your financial profile, investing portfolio, risk tolerance, and investing goals. You should always consult a financial professional for advice before investing in cryptocurrency to ensure it is right for your circumstances.